I, I call you John. It's only fair for you to call me Brian, and then that's fine. I, it's not a respect thing uh, for me. I uh, uh, I feel like I owe you my life. I entered this program uh, just before Christmas. I was a newlywed and uh, was getting ready to go on my honeymoon and being a faithful listener um, of Wayne's program, uh, I heard this advertisement for Energize Health and I investigated a little bit and uh, decided, um, this is interesting, I'll, it's at least where's the phone call. So um, I, I put in my, my number for our, on the website and lo and behold, I get the uh, return phone call, uh, not from a coach or a counselor, but the founder of the company, John. And I, that impressed me because I knew that there were tens of thousands of people that had already gone through this program. And here the, the, the founder of the company was giving me a call. But uh, we talked for a while, and, and um, I said, you know, I'm, i got to tell you, I'm a little skeptical. This is, uh, you know, a fair amount of money uh, for me, and, and uh, I, I, I know that I, I could use the benefits because I've got health problems. I've got arthritis. I've got high cholesterol. I've got high blood pressure. I'm carrying around 30 pounds of, of too much weight. Um, I'm, I'm playing golf, and I'm stiff and sore the next day to where I can hardly walk. Um, I'm not enjoying my retirement like I wanted to. I mean, I, I worked for 30 years, worked my tail off, and I thought, you know, retirement was going to be this blessing to where I could enjoy, you know, enjoy my time uh, on, my own, um, on my own terms. And I really don't feel I'm doing that. And uh, he told me a little bit about his story. And, uh, and then he made some outrageous claims. He said, you know, Brian, I understand about arthritis. He said, uh, I was a football player growing up and uh, athlete. and I, I wore my knees down to where I was bone on bone. What that means is there's no more cartilage in the knees. That bone is actually rubbing on bone. And it's it's um, something that I saw in anesthesia all the time when I was doing uh, cases because what they do is they come in and they get knee replacements. They get titanium uh, or ceramic knees put in. Um, they last about 10 years and then they're, they wear out. And there's no real other treatment. I mean, there just is none. Um, and he said, you know, I, I did this program uh, myself 25 years ago, and I did it twice in a row. He said, I, I felt good enough after the, the first round that I decided I'd, I'd do it again. And he said, um, it was amazing. The difference in me, I, I regenerated my cartilage in my knees. He said, now I run stairs every weekend uh, at a stadium, up and down, just because I can, uh, just, just to remember what it felt like when I was a kid. John, you can't do that. That doesn't happen. You don't regenerate cartilage. Do you have, do you have a stem cell injection? I did not. <laughs> John, that doesn't happen. It's just it's not possible medically. I'm, I mean, I'm speaking as a physician. It's, it's, not, it's, not, it's not, not possible. He said, I'm living proof. And then he told me a little bit more and, and told me about his Christian background. And I knew this guy was not going to lie to me. So I said, okay, well, I'm a skeptic, but sign me up and sign my wife up too. We'll do it. We'll do it together. And, uh, but I got to tell you, I, I, I feel like I got a refund coming my way because I, <laughs> I'll tell you right now, I, I don't see this work. <laughs> so uh, started the program, went on our honeymoon uh, about two weeks later and, uh, was surprised that the, the water, drinking lots of water issue is hard on vacation, but uh, sticking to the other parts of the program was pretty easy on vacation. We were able to do that. And, um, but finished, finished the 88 days and said, man, I feel really good. 
looked at my numbers. My weight was much better. I had a doctor's appointment coming up. And um, so I got my lab drawn, went to the doctor. And um, I had noticed that, you know, with all this weight loss and how good I was feeling, you know, maybe I can back off some of this medicine a little bit. Yeah. So a couple of weeks before the appointment, I started taking less of my blood pressure medicine, less of my cholesterol medicine. I, I, uh, I took about half of my uh, diabetes medicine altogether um, for six weeks before. But then two weeks before, I just stopped it, stopped taking metformin tablets. And uh, had my lab work drawn, went to the doctor, and he said, <laughs> what happened to you? So I've been, uh, been on this new health kick. And he said, wow, you look you look great. And he said, I got to tell you, these numbers are fantastic. He said, your cholesterol is absolutely normal, uh, which even on the medicine, you know, even on the medicine you're on, bef um, still it's, you know, to be normal, it, it wasn't before when you're taking this medicine. So you're looking good. I said, well, I'm really not taking all my medicine either, doctor. <laughs> he said, your blood's your blood sugar is uh, is normal, and then your hemoglobin A1C, which tracks your blood sugar over a long period of time. And he said, uh, that looks great, too. And he said, but uh, I, I got to tell you, it, this health kick, it's it's a matter of, of your diet, and that doesn't go away. So you've got to stay on this metformin because I think that's why it's it's where it is. I said, Doc, I haven't been on my metformin either. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, well... Um, well, okay, I'm going to shut up now, but you just keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> um, I went ahead um, and did another uh, 88 days immediately following. Um, I am still taking half of my uh, cholesterol medicine. I'm taking no diabetes medicine. I'm taking half of my high blood pressure medicine that I was before. I have lost uh, 33 pounds of scale weight. I lost 48 pounds of fat. I have uh, put on 10 pounds of muscle. Uh, and I gained 5 pounds of, of intracellular hydration um, for a net of, of 33 um, pound scale loss. And I feel great. I tell you, I, I am disappointed that there hasn't been better research into to this kind of health program a long time ago, but, you know, s studies, medical studies um, are basically driven by dollars in medical schools and in universities, and, and drug companies are the ones that are subsidizing that. And if there's no drug to sell, they have no interest in doing it. Now, drug companies are you know, have made great strides in the world and have, have provided us with lots of great medicines and helped us in a lot of arenas. And, and I understand their prof profit motivation, but, you know, you would think that natural, the scientists would still want to, to look for something that is natural, that is sustainable, and that could benefit everybody with no health risks. But they haven't. So all you have is testimonials of tens of thousands of people to look at and say, the program works. Don't believe it because you, you can't prove it that somebody can regenerate generate, um, cartilage in their knees except that it happens. You can't prove that somebody's kidneys who were so affected by years of taking non steroidal anti-inflammatory medicines for their aches and pains and arthritis like I did and had their kidney function down to 60%, that's irreversible kidney damage. No getting that back, except it did. My kidney function came back to where it still decreased, but only by 20%, not by 40%. I can't explain it that way. I, I, can't, I can't get... A kidney specialist to explain. I can't get an orthopedic surgeon to explain what happened to John, but
John believes that the body is meant to heal itself. As a Christian, I think it is the most incredible design um, ever created, and I believe. And I think that it's crucial that to achieve our potential, we have to take care of ourselves. It's worth investing in ourselves. In order to be a good father, in order to be a good Christian or Jew or Muslim, in order to, to better humanity and the world around us, we have to, be, we have to, to monitor our, our health and take care of ourselves enough that we can achieve all that we're meant to achieve and enjoy all that we're meant to enjoy. And uh, because of that, John, I owe you my life. Thank you.